Welcome to the Measure Evaluation Excel to Google Earth Mapping Tool Tutorial Series. FAQ number 9, Step 8 Error Messages. Let's say we're mapping Botswana at the first administrative level. There are nine administrative districts in Botswana. In column A we have them listed. In column B we have a set of test values called test val. Let's say we've started the macro and gone through the first seven steps in mapping the data in column B. And in step seven, we've chosen to group by quantiles. We'll click continue. Say that in step eight, we've chosen five as the number of classes, which is the default. We'll get the following message. Data are unevenly distributed. Number of classes reset to four. This is because we have a total of only eight values, leaving uneven classes if we try to produce as many as five. Four is a better number of classes, and the program will automatically reset to this number if we choose OK. Now um, another message that we may see is the following. No data for one observation. This message is generated because we have a missing value in cell B6, as you'll note here. The program will automatically eliminate this observation with the missing data and will rank in quantiles based on the other eight observations. If you click OK to go to the next step, you'll see that the missing value gets a class of its own, which is gray in this case. The other observations are divided into four even classes, each containing two values. Click on the Continue button and follow the remaining dialogues to gen generate your map. We hope this information has been useful to you. If you have any questions or further suggestions for improvement, please contact us at e2ghelp at unc.edu.